Hello everybody, I'm going to demonstrate how to use Blender to make a rib. Alrighty. First off, I need to get rid of that square. So uh, I'm going to right click the square to select it, tap X, and hit Enter to confirm to delete it. Next, I'm going to hold down Shift and tap the A key to get to the Add menu. I'll go to Curve here and I'll introduce a circle. Click left to select it. Here's the circle. Now this circle is, like I say, a circle. To be a part of a rib, that is the diameter of a rib, we'd have to scale it. So S to scale. And I'm going to scale to the X, I think. So yeah, X. There, we'll make it more like a rib sort of shape. All right, zoom out. Now I'm going to introduce something else. If I hold down Shift and tap A again, I'll go back to Curve here and introduce a Bezier curve. It's right on top of it, so let me move it over here. Now this Bezier curve here, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go into edit mode uh, by tapping tab. There, now I'm in edit mode. And I'm going to right click and drag it out and make it longer. Uh, hit left to select it, I mean to execute it. Uh, right click again and hold down to make it more of a curve here. Uh, Right click here to make it bend out. What you're doing is shaping the path of your rib. So I'll just go with this right now. Uh, and also I think that the rib is a little bit too big. That is the diameter of it. So I'm back in object mode. Right click. And uh, I'm going to scale it and just make it a lot smaller there. Okay. There we go. Now I think it's the right diameter. And that's a decent path for a rib, I suppose. So uh, I will select one last time the path. And I'm going to sweep this oval along this path. Here's how you do it. It's up here, but you need to move out a little bit to see it. So scroll this out. There it is. It's this one here, the curve next to the wrench. Go ahead and click that. Bezier curve is already selected. And what we're going to do is scroll down here, and we're going to bevel this object using the circle. There. So at this point, you have what basically looks like a rib. Uh, you can scale it, make it longer or shorter, and work from there. Thank you very much.